There we go. So, first thing I want to tell you is with knives, okay? These are kitchen knives, these are utensils. We use them as a tool to get food prepared, okay? Kitchen knives have only one sharpened blade. Sharp here on the blade side, not on the back side. Many come to a point, not all of them. Right? Don't confuse them with blades, with knives that have blades on both sides and are sharp on both sides. Those are for self-defense. That's different. Okay? So these are tools for cooking. Okay? For getting food prepared. It has a handle and it has the blade. Good. Okay. Just checking to see if she's checking yet. Oh my god, that would be so you're scaring us So you have a couple different things that you're gonna do. This one here, you're gonna explore different ways of cutting things. So each of you will have your very own bottled play now. Oh I was so young and young for a second. And I have Julianne, you make little tiny ribbons. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then, of course, oh, yeah. these are just. Is it edible Play Doh? No. No, it's not edible. The Play Doh I would not eat because it is equal parts flour and no, salt no. and water. Wait. Yeah, I would not eat that. That wouldn't taste great, really no, no. but it would work just fine. No, but I heard that there's edible Play Doh. Yeah, there is, but not this one. Um, it's non toxic. We have, uh, I do have a recipe. We can make it. We have uh, play doh that is peanut butter based. So if you guys are not allergic to peanut, we could try that. Jose, the, the table. Oh, no. no thank you. Do not do that with a knife, okay? So you'll be there. You'll have plastic knives for that station. Yay! Okay. Over here, where you'll be exploring. Different types of knives and the parts of the knives. And again, I have the awesome tactile. This was so much fun to make. I'm so, so proud of this. <laughs> oh, yeah, I went on lots of things. Yes, and this one, um, they're actually to scale for each knife so you can see which is larger and smaller. And we have a bowl also of various kitchen gadgets that you can explore. I mean, it's the kitchen knives. I was like, we're not Now, working. I don't want you just, you know, grabbing the kitchen knives with your hands. So, to protect you, I have a cut proof glove. <gasps> oh, and if you do go. take the knife and try to stab your hand, the point of the knife will hurt you. You'll feel that. Yeah. As far as actually slicing your hand, no. So please keep that in mind. Okay? And if you do poke your hand, you'll know. Yeah. Okay? So, yeah. you have the gloves, and you can use the gloves to, like I said, to touch the edge of the knife to feel. That there, some of them are different from others in size and what we use them for and things like that. Okay, and what was the last one? Where'd it go? <clears throat> I had one more station and it was over here. And oh, yes, that's the fruit cutting one. So at fruit cutting, you'll get to use the finger guards, which are like little shields that you use on your hands. And you can choose if you want to use a steak knife, a butter knife, or a plastic knife, whichever you're most comfortable with. I want to use a steak knife. <laughs> and you can choose to either cut, I have bananas and I have apples. Like I said, if we have more time, which we will eventually, then we'll be able to uh, cook stuff. Actually cook and then eat. Yeah. Oh, we yeah. want to see dinner. Yeah. This is like the preparation of power. Yeah. So, you have two hands. You have your knife hand. Whichever hand you hold the knife in, and you have your guard uh, guiding hand, which guides the food toward the knife. Okay? You wear the guard on the guiding hand. You keep your hand kind of like a claw. Like Jose Mojas. Okay? And that way, when you're cutting, the guard is always protecting your finger. Okay? If you have your fingers out straight, yes, you'll hit the guard, but it's also really hard to hold the food itself. Okay? So you'll use that. Make sure to keep pinkies and thumbs out of here. Keep everything, yes. Yeah. And with a claw, that will keep those pulled back so that you don't have to worry about hurting ourselves. Okay? So, you'll be practicing. I'm going to use pinkies, so. Any questions?